results in the local elections represent a vote of confidence in Conservatives' councils, while questions over Jeremy Corbyn's leadership played a significant role in Labour failing to make further inroads, according to the leader of the local government association's Conservative group. David Simmons told LGC the combination of a strong message on delivering on local priorities and a leadership seen to be acting in the national interest helped to maintain the Conservatives' position as the largest party in local government. He said, the conservative message has very much been about the ability to get things done on behalf of residents in an electoral terms that appears to have paid off, so we should treat it as a vote of confidence. One of the things that came over strongly on the doorstep was voters felt the conservative party was showing leadership in the national interest in a way they felt probably with the troubles over anti-Semitism and other things, Jeremy Corbyn simply wasn't. CLLR Simmons, who is deputy leader of Hillingdon LBC where the Conservatives strengthened their control of the borough despite being targeted by Labour, said his party had now moved away from the tradition of doing badly in local elections after doing well in a general election. He said, internally the party and councils have learned from each other on how you identify the needs and wants of residents and make sure that is what you are delivering. CLLR Simmons also paid tribute to Sean Anstey, the former conservative leader of Trafford MBC, which is now under no overall control with Labour as the largest party. He said, Sean has done a really good job in residence satisfaction with services is extremely high, there, it is the one really sad piece of news for the conservative local government family. 4,000 people were denied the chance to vote in the five areas trial and voter ID pilot schemes, the Electoral Reform Society has estimated. Labour has won four mayoral contests in London with two new faces replacing long-serving politicians. I want to highlight three councils where significant local controversy has not had any major impact at the ballot box. Labour has so far largely failed to make the breakthroughs it anticipated on a night in which a UKIP wipeout largely benefited the Tories. Labour council leaders have called on the National Party leadership to trust local government to deliver change in the event of a general election victory and handed a greater role in national policy decisions. The controversial Herringy Development Vehicle HDV, proposal will be ditched if Labour maintains control of the council in the upcoming elections, the local party has confirmed.